Hello there, and welcome back to Lawn War 2. We've got ourselves an Advent Retaliation. It is our second one, I believe. There's a civvy there. Defend the Haven. Need to save as many of them as possible. That's potentially great. Guarantee one, dude. I don't regret putting it on Intel. To be fair, we actually had it on hiding, actually. Um, it's really far. I don't know what's there, but let's do it anyway. Location confirmed. Nothing. Fascinating. Who else do we have? Tommy? He can't even reach them. Tommy, man, come on. Oh. We can move you at least to the evac. So I think we can save three of them here by the looks of it. That's enough to put, put them on recruit and get us what we're looking for, you know? Uh, so yeah, here's the squad. A bunch of people. Uh, we are like, I'm like in the middle of the map or something. Also, there's no one on the map, is there? So, you know what? That's, yeah, that's a faceless. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. No, that's good. That's good. Let's get rid of this faceless. He is out in the open. We can take him out early. Hello. Don't worry, buddy. We got it. We've got it from here. So, Serrano. 98% chance to hit only. What's a precision shot? Only 44 crit. I think we'll save the precision shot. A steady weapon? Maybe. You never know, actually. No one else can really do anything, so... I think you should take a shot. In nice. Right in his faceless face, I suppose. Two percent, that's um, great. <laughs> now what do I do to make Tommy useful this turn? I kind of have to move someone out the way. I think I have to move Paul out the way. Because safe to say, move him here. Go. Now, can Tommy reach. Is that... does that count? I don't know. That should, I think. <laughs> anyway. Serrano. Yeah, take the shot. Whenever so-and-so's finished doing... Ah, that's a bad sign. <laughs> that's another faceless. <laughs> Uh-oh. Yeah, take the shot anyway. Please get the kill. Thank you very much. At least we're clearing out these faceless. Also, I've given Tommy a Fulton harness, so... Uh, I suppose that could help. What we can do, at least, is... Yeah, go boop on his head with a grenade. That was shocking. Barricade, you've got soul fire. That is actually quite decent. You've got flamethrower, meaning if you are burning, you can't That's use it. melee. Barricade again, right here. Okay. Yeah, it's probably the best thing we can do. Might get a decent damage roll anyway. That's not bad. That's not bad. You might burn to death. Probably not, though. That's you, Soulfire. Quite happy that we've managed to get rid of two Faceless. Ooh, Paracat. Welcome to the show. He is an old schooler, though. He really is. He should be in that squad, and I may even put him there. But we'll see. I was going to put him with Carnivores. Right, at least we've got Ever Vigilant with Tom. Was the idea of sprinting him up ahead. Two faceless are taken care of. We've got a stun lancer, a mech, and what looks like a scout. No doubt, Mark II stun lancer. No sign of them. We don't actually see them. That I was not expecting, though it is intriguing. Fulton Harness. Oh, we can... Yeah, that's not a bad shout.
do we just settle for what we've got? That is the question. We can't do that, obviously. We have to sort of come around here. And do this. We don't know where they are. We do have... Yeah, we, we've got to move. We've got to move. We can't Resistance not... Resistance has done everything it can to convince people to join the cause. But it's an uphill battle when you've got Advent whispering propaganda in your ear 24 hours. Okay, good. That's that's a really good thing that we've activated them. Fantastic. We know where they are now, because I was really not sure. <laughs> okay, we can't haywire. It's not in sight, that is unfortunate. But we can flashbang. You still, you can't haywire either. That tree, that's why. Victor! That's, that's garbage, that is absolute garbage. Let's move you up here. Move you closer. Unfortunately, the aim of this is going to be embarrassing. Uh, just take it anyway, see who you get. Okay, you didn't get the mech. I'm still happy with that though, because that means I think you... Very nice shot there, but that's also a soul fire finish. Both of them are soul fire finishes. Uh, but we've already used one soul fire, haven't we? There we go, you can, yeah, you can get one of them. Any full cover? None of this is full cover. Sure thing. Whatever. Oh, can you see through that car then? How does that work? Okay, can, you can. The scout... You both, <laughs> you're both the sort of enemies that are going to have good dodge. So... Yeah, uh, who can Serrano see? This one here, right? Still see him from there? You should be able to. Yeah, forty percent though. What the hell happened there? Okay, that's kind of BS, but I guess we'll have to just accept it, won't we? So you could disorientate mechanical enemies, or we can run and gun you and do something there. Alright, get rid of the stun lancer. Bit annoyed by that. How come 50%? Whatever. How that's happened. That's how it's done. We might as well take it. Not gonna do anything else. Okay. That is also acceptable. <laughs> Beautiful. Um, Barracat. We can move you up, but you're guaranteed to burn, apparently. You just you just love... Oh, no matter what happens, you're going to be on fire, aren't you? Shoot. How's, how does that work, eh? How the hell does that work? We need someone to go back here and get that one. Unfortunately, I think it's going to have to be Tommy. Barracat, what's going on, buddy? Uh, what, what, what the hell? Oh, we use... Do you know what? We are going to make it you. I get that you're burning, but... Good, you're a civvy. Um... Hopefully that should get rid of it. Last time that didn't work though. No, did it not work? No, I saw someone. I was randomly watching someone's video and it just didn't work, which made no sense. Who was it? I can't remember now. Oh, I don't use the Fulton Harness, man. But we can't. Okay, Karen Richardson. Get in here. Hunker. Ainsley Harriet. What are we gonna do with a you? Well, first of all, let's 
Let's get shredding, shall we? Something like that. Let's start get, getting rid of this mech. You might be able to take it out yourself. Move you here to the tree. Okay, boys. See you. <laughs> Good luck. You've got the shard gun. Here's our first use of the shard gun. Let's see if you can make it count. No, you can't. Unfortunate, however, if Ainsley can get into a position, just one little position. Definitely, man. Oh, come on, Ainsley. Come on, man. Shoot. He might move. In fact, I'm going to bank on them. As long as the reinforcements don't come in over there, no, they're coming to the right. That's really bad. <laughs> that's, that's right behind us. And there goes our fucking overwatch. When am I going to get an overwatch that works? No! <gasps> Never happens. I'm yet, I'm yet to see the benefits of overwatching. I really am. I don't know what's going on here. That's a lot of damage. Hmm. Blake, I'm sorry, but... Tommy, you're just awful, dude. You've been awful. Campaign. You have your moments, but... And you, sh you shouldn't be burning because a hunker down is supposed to stop it. I don't get this game. I really don't get this game. It's full of nonsense. Okay, you're just a tap from being dead. As is everyone, actually. Let's face it. Over okay, Ainsley, there is no one else you're going to be able to affect, so I don't see the point in, I guess, doing anything other than shotgunning you. Not Ainsley, Tommy. Next turn you can use the Fulton Harness, perhaps. That's Assuming we can deal with the rest, which I don't see how the hell we're going to deal with them. Ah, oh, we can burn that snake. I think. Das kann ich machen. We've got options here. We do have more options than I think I'm giving the team credit for. Okay, yeah, if you're burning, then... Well, that takes care of you. Fantastic. Well, it doesn't take care of you, but it does, I think, until we can get out of here. So that's good. We can't jump over this side, which is really annoying. Like, hmm. no, that's not a thing, apparently. You can see him from there. That's that's kind of cool. But what do you do about the other snake? I guess this is where our other side operative comes in. Pool. So where can Paul see the other snake? Nowhere. There. Right there. On my way. I think this is where we have to use insanity. Wow, that's not good. Reality is fleeting. Come on. Uh, should have should have figured that. You're just not, you just refuse to not burn. That doesn't help us at all. So what we're going to do is we'll move you here. Okay. Cutie. Yeah, you're a civvy, kind of figured based on math you would be. I say that like I knew what I was doing. Let's face it, I didn't really know what I was doing. So I'm here, there's nothing else we can be able to do. We're gonna have to move Ainsley up here. Moving along here quite beautifully. 
going to have to move Barracat here. Yeah, what else are you going to do? Okay. Yeah, take the shot on the Centurion. Ooh! Big hit. Big shot. Two, two health? Two health, guys? You know what that means? He's a combat protocol from death. Ooh. Flank shot. Nice, but... Dead Mutant Centurion is always top of the menu. Alright, love, lovely bit of mutton there. Okay. What's have we got? Not much. <laughs> but we do have command. That's kind of what I was... Uh, saving over here. So, Paul has a flashbang and hasn't used it. So does Richter. Paul cannot use insanity. He's used your rocket. I guess it's just use either either or. Yeah, no, that's, that's not going to help us at all. That might though, but maybe I'll save that for next turn. Uh, let's bring out Paul because your grenades are less useful. We'll have both both insanity and soul fire next turn. Let's flashbang this fella. Okay, and now let's hope for the best. I suppose. Do we want to advertise these guys? Not really. We're here to get them out of here. Let's face it. Like, um, I suppose if we move... You're going to be the first one to move and then we'll just take random shots. But then it might be enough to kill you with the burning. So, yeah. Ever vigilant. May just do the trick. Okay, good luck. I'm not going to lie, this isn't going great. Oh, of course, the reinforcements always go first. But I guess we'll just miss one of them. So are they behind us? Yeah, that, that's the dead muton. They're in the same area, so we've kind of got them surrounded a bit. Nope. Take a random shot on him. And miss as everyone bloody does with Overwatches. I just don't see the appeal. Overwatch is it's just such an end game thing, isn't it? Only works in the end game. This, however, looks good for a flame. Right, Ainsley. Wow, okay, you miss. Hey, no that's... swashbuckler. Yeah, the old swashbuckler. And not bad. Not bad at all. You can't still be burning, can you? There's no longer burning. Okay. Right, Kidi can use Jammer. We can just sort of do things here. So, Serrano is in a brilliant position to just get a finishing shot. But we need to move him out, so we kind of need to plan a few steps ahead. One thing we do want to do, I reckon, is move... No, that's, that's too much fire there. Alright, yeah, a little bit of a chain reaction thing going here. So who's, who has to move first? Serrano kind of does. I'm just wondering if I want to aid protocol anyone. Oh, I, was, I kind of thought maybe you could combat protocol with that guy, but apparently that is not an option. Interference is. Or we can just guarantee a shutdown. That's not bad. I think we'll just keep that guy out for a turn. And then we'll move everyone into a position where they can just evac. 
All we want is to get a few civilians out of here. Ooh, tempting. No. <laughs> we would have failed that. That's a fail. I've seen that before. <laughs> Alright, so the mech is down. We do not need to deal with them whatsoever. We've got... I think the Viper is now the biggest threat. That's a, that's a T1 engineer. The Viper being the biggest threat. Serrano, unfortunately, though, cannot get into a position where you can sort of deal with him nicely, I guess. Oh, there's a... Hello. There's a fella there as well. Okay. Fine. How can you not see him from there? Oh, the, the door, that's why. Tommy can't do anything anyway, so... He's not going to be able to make it out this turn, is he? The next turn, that is. So, whatever. Let's just get this mech. Because we can. Next turn we can then get the... I think we can just about reach there to get the... This is so slow! I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm stuttering because he's just so slow. Hurry up, dude. Um... Kidi, what are your options? I know we've got Jammer. Which we may have to use because someone's going to have to run an Overwatch otherwise. That's just... The other one that's burning. I, if it was one of the other ones, I think I'd consider it. But... I can't quite reach any of them in one move. Which is unfortunate. Leave you here. And then we pop Jammer. Did that work? Hard to tell. That told me nothing. Oh, I just realized. Are you going to be able to make it out? Your mobility is amazing, but is it that amazing? Is another question. That was not the best move I've made. Okay, let's just play it. Seven. Isn't that how much? You've got like six health, don't you? Okay, and apparently you have eight. I could have sworn you had six health. Fine. Can handle that. I'm not worried. We barricade over here. Here's where we really kind of need an insanity to work. Well, I hope he is. Panicked. Fantastic. Out for a turn. We can ignore that trooper. Got soul fire. Do that on the engineer. It's that viper, though. It's the tricky one. You've, you've yeah, you shut down the mech, didn't you? Som? Can... Flash Flashbang the Viper. I just don't see how we're going to kill him. The others we can deal with, courtesy of soul fire. Or grenades. I don't think anyone's got grenades, so... We've got four civilians? Is this? I think so. Two, three. Yeah, it looks. Uh, is there another one up there? Or oh, is it three? Is that here? Jesus, that's bad. Okay, we've got a grenade. Let's move Rick to here. Just need to clip the grenadier. Get a nicer angle. There. Okay. And then I think we'll use a soul fire to take care of you. This is this is our last freaking action. Jeez, yeah, I don't think we're getting out this turn, you know. That's not good, is it? Hey, 
and you can use it from here. So let's do that. Aye, aye, aye. The tissue melts away. I hope so. At some point it'll stop burning. By the numbers. All right, we need to start just going. Just, just going. Good, yes, yeah, so jammer worked. Okay, Ainsley, stay down. Well done. Keep drawing fire. Alright, brilliant. Now, here's where we make a sort of just sweep to, to the exit. Uh, Kitty, you still can't reach anyone. Probably could have done something this turn, but a bit late now, isn't it? Let's get the three civvies we do have out of here. Okay, gee, back down to three. Uh, Tommy, can Keep you? Keep in mind, if you have any problems, talk to me and I will help you. That's very nice. Don't see how it's gonna help. Anyway, let's take a faceless corpse, because we can. Serrano, you are quite far away. Fortunately, you're a fantastic sprinter. So we can dash you this turn. That's no problem. Just what do we do about the rest of you, eh? Here's the question. If we flashbang over here, can we get two of you? It's just you three, right? Fill the air with gorgeous aromas. Oh, do it. Stop talking about it and do it. This is pretty close to the exit, so we can probably move Rick to here, point blank shot, but then how else do we deal with him? Probably Tom over here, we can take a shot, but we know what's going to happen. We're going to get baddies coming in, doing their horrible stuff. Can you not see the Viper at all? Barricat has a soul fire. Is Trojan going to be enough to kill? I don't think it is. We might have to use a grenade there. Alternatively. Ooh. Now that. That is good. Richter in here. We know we're not killing that Viper, but we, we, what we can do is just graze this Mech Archer, just so Trojan Protocol definitely does enough. Yeah, do you see where I'm going here? So this is where we bring Kidi into the equation. There is she. There she is. Get a nice stab here. Mm -hmm. They've seen me. That's all right. Well, they meant to. But the last thing he's going to see is that blade. Oh, not quite though. That's not a problem. It still isn't actually a problem. We can combat protocol the way. Could have combat protocol the mech, I guess. I guess what we'll do here is we'll actually soul fire. At least we, even though Barakat's going to be injured, at least he's got a promotion. Small victories, right? This is definitely turning into a bit of a, what's it called, a Fearic victory? No problem, Commander. Have you flashbanged already? I'm starting to forget what I've already done. Yep. Come to think about it, can you actually dash out of it there next turn. I don't think you can. So, Team, I'm moving out. Yeah. yeah. You can, so it's a case of do we do we mind merge? Probably mind merge with uh, Ainsley since you're going to be the number one target. Richter, just need to graze here. Just do something. Oh nice. Trojan should, should definitely finish you off. Love it. 
Uh, can you see Ainsley? Of course you can't. Well, in the off chance that you do go for monster, at least we can give you a blade too. Okay, good luck. And oh, still another move. Could invigorate for I don't know why. I don't know what reason we would have to do that. Ah. Uh, Let's just move Paul back. No problem. Okay. Good luck. Please be no, no more mechs. They are out of range by the looks of it. Is that double reinforcements? It is. Of course they've been pushed back one turn. They are right by us. Damn it, there's a mech. God damn it. God, I'm fed up of seeing mechs. One of their freaking overwatches. Stressing me out. Alright, Trojan did as it was supposed to. Fine. Ooh, there's everyone. Berserker. Ooh, that's nasty. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Right, there's our, that's our big worry. Okay, fine. That's a miss. And that should be it. It's our turn now. Mech is looking away, which is very interesting. Okay, not to worry. We are out of here this turn, I believe. Who's the slowest? I think everyone with bigger weapons is already closer, so... Tommy, this is kind of on you right now. Best I can do is this and then command him. That really is it. But the thing is, Kitty needs to sprint anyway. So. No? I guess is the answer to that. Um, this is bad. But interference? Still doesn't help, because how would you get out? But you can still get out. As long as you go back this way. You're alright. That's fine. It's okay, okay. Good. I'm already injured. Uh, you can pick up. Yeah, sure, this trooper. Why not? Free supplies, I'll take it. Oh, I thought you weren't going to make it there. Yeah, I'd be worried. Ah, oh no, you can't see it. That's fine. Okay, cool. That's, you know, can you. Oh, you're the one in trouble. Let's see. What if you move back one tile? Is that is that too far out of range? No, you would you are going to take an Overwatch. That's fine. We can mind merge. Understood. Barricat here. Okay, that's it. Cyoperative, stick together. That's one way we can help this out. Gives you five ablative. Kidi, you've got a you've got a dash anyway to get out. No need to ask twice. Well, we can't have you guys run out just yet. We can have you go out this way, ah, Serrano. Ainsley out this way. Tommy, no matter what we do, you're always going to be just a. Only a dagger. We, you randomly had a smoke grenade. Be great. Lightning reflexes. What am I? How did I forget about the best ability in the game? <laughs> uh, that was that was stupid of me. 
Uh, Alright, well, there you go. 6%, 0%. Got a soul fire. You might kill this engineer. There is technically a chance that you will. Hey! What on, Paul? Alright, well, we've got our three dudes and now we're gone. Oh, yeah. That was not a great mission. Three's enough to recover from. We're gonna have to stick someone there. We'll switch them to recruit and hope that we don't get a recruit raid, which we shouldn't since only three people are on it. Shouldn't happen. So, two wounded. Barakat heavily wounded because of the... the freaking burningness. Very annoying. Ah, oh well. Everyone's alive, that's all that matters. Unfortunately, we have two soldiers less for the next mission, but we'll come to that in a moment. Okay, did we at least squeeze out any promotions from this? We did on Richter. I went on Tommy. <laughs> He's the last person who deserves one. Alright, we are in fact going to go for Formidable. Although, yeah, no Formidable. That's what we'll go with. Tommy, stun gunner, yeah. Bonus chance to hit. What's it like? Plus 30, plus 20, and increases by 5 with each. Well, that sounds good to me. That could be very useful. So, Barakat is wounded for 17 days. Ah. Didn't even look like he got a promotion either, so that kind of sucks. We did manage to extract a faceless corpse and a mech and a trooper. Still, not great. Really not ideal. So Saker is in training here. However, that doesn't matter. Because how many soldiers are available? Eight soldiers. I believe that's exactly how many we need to do whatever on earth it was that we were going to do. I've completely forgotten. Take a little bit of a, a break, you see. Is this it? Extract VIP, scientist, intel package. Yes. Course for that is in fact what it is. So we don't have Carpenter available and we don't have Barricade, but that's fine. We've got a good enough squad. We've got the... yeah, some real core members of old schoolers. Not bad. My mobility, I like it. And we're also going to take out Ainsley, who does have airdrop, comet protocol, haywire. Yeah, he's going to be very effective. I like it. Assaults can be very useful on this mission as well, so we will take out Tommy. And I'm thinking we're going to have to take out Paul. He's already... Oh, look how close that is. Uh, that seems like it's worth it though. It's for a scientist for frick's sake. And an intel package. You guys don't have alloy plating though. Which is absurd. Oh, that was going to take it forever. Alright, hang on. I'll cut to whenever I've sorted it out. So unfortunately that little mishap has lost us an hour. Or at least, I'm sure it was just about 10 minutes, but that's dropped it down essentially. So we may actually under-infiltrate here. I don't mind boosting it, but just because it's for a damn scientist. I mean, we need to stock up on them. We're on a roll of them right now. So let's keep that going. So a nice squad of six would be really effective. If we can keep it at an extremely light, then this could be a nice, fun, steady mission. Everyone has alloy plating, so they all have a, an extra point of ablative armor, which is very useful. Do you want to give Serrano anything? I don't think so. I love his high mobility. I absolutely love it. You can get some beautiful flanking shots. I've decided to give Tommy the Talon round. That would be really nice with his fantastic new shard gun. Not that he ever gets much chance to use it because he's so slow. He's kind of a bit crap, really. <laughs> but yeah, anyway. Kitty, you got to lead them. She's got the Fulton Harness. Let's send him out. Good luck, everyone. Sky Ranger in position to drop. So off they go. Next is obviously well, it's either Dean's dogs. No, it's not them. It's four days. It's actually going to be carnivores. Clearly, they're down to very light, and they are looking to get some intel and counter a dark event. 
But in the meantime, over here we want to switch you to recruit and give you. I guess it's going to be Amy. I need to make her an officer because she's always there. I really do, don't I? Do you have anyone better by any chance? You've got an engineer. No. If we got rid of a couple of faceless from that haven, that's actually quite awesome. Very light. You're okay. You went to full. I have a castle. Could you? Could you recruit to the haven in Western Europe? Oh, oh, brilliant! We recruited someone. Finally, gee, it took a while. Uh, let's switch you all to Intel. I think six is enough to maybe just about get a mission since we're going to have two squads back momentarily. Uh, who do we have down here? You're all on Intel. Why? Smash and grab, and this one up here. So we still could get Lib 3, is it? I think in this region. Right, 125. Okay, so that's already been dropped to very light. Joe Smith, something, blah blah blah. Uh, okay, you're a specialist. Good for you. I'm very happy for you. You're still very light. How are Dean? Dean's dogs are also very light. Need to keep going. Oh, wow, that's double trouble. 23 hours. Unhindered operations. Wow, another one straight away. And we've got it down here. That's that's a haven again. Now to protect the data tap. How does this work? Oh, resistance to recruiters. Oh, we're about to just lose this region. Um, I can accept losing a region. But this is not okay. Over here. One day on that. You're, you're on extremely light now. What about you? You're both on extremely, extremely light. So I don't know which one we're going to run first, but you can see where the next few missions are going. We've run both of these. We bring Dean's dogs back, or members that are meant to be Dean's dogs on this mission, to counter this dark event. And then carnivores. Hopefully this is a good squad here. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, that's a mixture, but free, you'll get a guaranteed promotion. You'll get a guaranteed promotion because of Khan. And yeah, we'll get this fantastic squad back, actually. Yeah, nice. I like it. I like it a lot. There's more than like three members of Dean's Dogs here. Broadmoor's in it. What the hell? That's okay. You'll both be back. And then we'll have a lot of soldiers to play with. So whether or not we do even want to run this mission, I'm kind of tempted just to say goodbye to this region. It gets to a point because apparently these missions are just, just horrible. Just horrible. But the question is, do we lose? Yeah, we do. I think we lose her. We might have to do it anyway. But I've got time to think about that. So anyway, <laughs> I'm going to see you next time. Uh, I'm not sure which mission I'm going to run first. Maybe just to do you know what? No, I think I'm going to run Dean's Dogs first because this mission is more likely to go a little bit awry, I suppose. Glitter, Needle, Gustavo, Curtis. Yeah, it's a dodgy squad. We've got to recover an item. We don't even have a specialist. What, what, what am I thinking with this one? I don't know. But it... Still extremely light. I suppose as long as you guys have decent weapons. Did I give you a? Oh, I did. Oh, you got a nice sniper. Which has got laser. You've got an arc blade. You're you're just boom boom booms, and you're also boom boom booms, but you're double boom boom booms. You can just use rocket, then a rocket. Okay, maybe they'll cope. We'll see. We'll see. Until then, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.